The beautiful main facade of the Cathedral Santiago de Compostela rises proudly into the sky. The final destination of a legendary medieval pilgrimage route. For more than 1,200 years, the marvelous buildings of the old town, as well as this striking cathedral, have attracted visitors from all over the world. During the Middle Ages, the town enjoyed great prominence in addition to Jerusalem and Rome, Santiago de Compostela was the third most important Christian pilgrimage destination. The cathedral dates back to the 9th century. In the course of time, the sanctuary was gradually extended and improved. The Obraduaro facade is typical of the Spanish late Baroque style of the 18th century. Its beautiful main facade combines various decorative and architectural elements that are to be found along the Pilgrim's Way, the Camino de Santiago. In addition to the imposing cathedral, there are further treasures hidden within the historical center of the town such as the 16th century Collegio de Fonseca. The college was named after its patron, the influential Archbishop Fonseca, who was responsible for many of the town's most important buildings. Santiago's fame originates from an old belief. Legend has it that in 813 AD, the remains of St. James the Apostle were discovered on the site of today's cathedral. Following the discovery of the grave, the king of Asturia and Galicia, Alphonse II, ordered the construction of the first chapel. However, nothing remains of the original clay-built church. In 997 AD, the Moorish army destroyed the Christian building. The cathedral of today is a splendid building. Shortly after the expulsion of the North African invaders, reconstruction of the cathedral began. Under the rule of Bishop Diego Jalmirez, both the town and its Catholic church enjoyed much prosperity and the diocese became an archbishopric. Unlike the architectural transformation of its external facade, most of the cathedral's interior has retained its original form.
The church's main nave and altar, with its precious and exquisite decoration, are a remarkable religious work of art. While strolling through the imposing interior of the cathedral, which leads to the choir, there are several fascinating works that date back to numerous epochs. The interior and its three naves seem to rise up to the heavens. In 1074, construction of Spain's first medieval cathedral began. Its construction took more than a century. Its architecture was inspired by various classical pilgrim basilicas of the time. The cathedral's typical Romanic structure and ground plan have remained intact to the present day. Only its external appearance has changed in rich Baroque style. The unique influence of Santiago de Compostela being one of the most important centers of the Christian world is evident in many historic buildings such as the San Martín Binario Monastery. For more than 150 years, the imposing 16th century building has been used as an academy by the city's university. The original Benedictine monastery was once taken over by the monks of the neighboring order of San Pio Anieltares. During the summer months, when the town fills up with both pilgrims and tourists, the monastery is transformed into a lodge. More than a thousand years have passed since the arrival of the first famous pilgrim, Bishop Godescal of Le Puy in the French Auvergne. Santiago de Compostela. Even today, the town has retained all of its magic, its cultural appeal and deep religious significance.